iodine it's one of the biggest remedies we have in homeopathic materia medica for thyroid related issues and it belongs to the mineral kingdom typically we know the generalities of iodine is a lot of emaciation restlessness and lot of hunger but when we did the proving for iodine at a deeper level there was a lot of feeling of betrayal a lot of deception and a feeling of being backstabbed someone is backstabbed and you know this is a pattern of halogens almost every iodine patient at some point has said that i felt backstabbed i felt betrayed i feel as if someone has just gone behind me and just very interesting in fatak there is a symptom ill effects of nervous shock and disappointed love the iodine person to get over this feeling of deception betrayal they try to get more busier and they try to monomaniacally get so busy 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 busy, busy, busy so much that they try to forget everything and because of this that is where their mind goes into a chaos too many thoughts too many thoughts too many thoughts and that's when they start doing meditation and that's when they go towards it and still they cannot get rid of it iodum is one of this very very impatient and impulsive remedy in homeopathy they will say i can't even sit still and all their problems probably come from the fact that they cannot sit still without doing anything iodum one of the very important patterns with iodum is not that they only have thyroid issue they often have many hormonal issue including the breast fibroadenoma including the fibroids including infertility and so on there are couple of dreams that i want to talk to you about in iodum number one is is the dream of eating even in the dream i i've i've seen and heard iodum patient saying that my god in my dream i went to this place and i ate the pizza or i went to that place and i was craving it for so long that i went and ate this so eating food is a very important pattern for iodum and the other pattern is stools or excrements so they have a rubric you can see dreams of excrements dreams of excrements smeared by very interesting the food is something you put in the excrements is something that goes out both have iodum as a single remedy in it shows a very interesting connection with the gastrointestinal tract huh? try to understand this at subconscious level what it means my idea is not to tell you this 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 remedy this my idea is to make you think at a deeper level what it means are you all with me and are, are you getting this kind of understanding the deeper conscious materia medica at a subconscious level iodum has a very interesting rubric and i'm going to read this iodum patients will often you will actually find them in in meditation in yoga in 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 groups and they will say i if i get out of this i'll go crazy i i feel like doing something impulsive all the time there is a rubric mania meditation ameliorate mania desire to do something very irresistible persistent thoughts taking possession of themselves mania of taking possession of themselves iodum this is where they start developing this state of glandular pathology like goiter which is very hard huh? magnesium carb iodum can have the very hard goiter they develop ovarian cyst many iodum patient develop rheumatoid arthritis one of my favorite uh, homeopath dr george vithulkas he says that if you want to understand iodum it's like a hot arsenic he says it looks like arsenic but he is very very hot and impulsive so it's a very interesting way of 
understanding the remedy iota it's a very interesting rubric impatience runs about never sits or sleeps at night the women with the hormonal issues get behavioral impulses to do things they could often be very sexual impulses and they want to constantly be busy one of the reason why ayodham wants to be busy is because he wants to get out of these thoughts there is this terrible psychological thought that goes in their mind that they cannot get it out and that's where they get into this pattern of bipolar disorders schizophrenia this is the this is the deeper pattern of iodam huh? i hope you can hear me and i hope you can see me someone write that the screen is not visible let's now try to understand a little bit about different salts of iodam and this thyroid session is going to continue because i'm going to tell you a lot about different remedies of thyroid um but today i'm going to talk to you only about iodam huh? because it's a very important remedy let's talk about calcarea iodam and this is a very important remedy which i use a lot and um, it's a very useful remedy typically in cases of children with adenoids tonsillitis this becomes a very important remedy calcarea iodide will have fears of calcarea and the theme of iodide but the main symptom on which i have often used calc iodide is that all the thyroid symptoms starts from puberty thyroid or goiter from puberty has only two remedies calcarea iodide and hydrastis canadensis i had a very interesting case of calcarea iodide who had this symptom on which we prescribe and it really improved very beautifully the one thing about calcarea iodide that i have confirmed is that they have a lot of desires and they they have this very uh, interesting pattern where they love luxurious life they love the kind of cars and they like the movie stars and they like all very fancy stuff they have this extreme desire for grandeur in calcarea iodide there's a single rubric impatience on hunger single remedy calcarea iodide and massimo one of my favorite homeopaths writes it's a very interesting symptom that calcarea iodide always feels better after eating but they eat so much that afterward they feel guilty oh why did i eat this so they may go to delhi and eat a lot of food and then they feel oh god why did i eat this is calcarea iodide a lot of desire for milk and chocolate artichokes calcarea iodide one of the one of the very old classical homeopath often used to tell me that calcarea iodide is a very good remedy in in women who have who in husbands whose women have infertility so he told me that whenever he sees a case of infertility he gives the indicated remedy whatever it is and to the husband he always gives calcarea iodide and he says that it is 90% of the time successful i haven't applied it but i'm just sharing this very interesting clinical anecdote that i learned from someone once so interesting no different different remedies we are learning we are really learning many many things together my god 
let's go to the next remedy ferromyoditum ferromyoditum it's very important in women's cases and the main symptom is goiter or thyroid symptoms comes up after suppression of menses so what you will often see is a woman who has who has been diagnosed of pcod and after few months she has a goiter this is very typical for ferromyod so ferromyod often you just look at the clinical history that will give you an indication to ferrum iod when menses are stopped due to certain hormonal changes in the body and there is amenorrhea the menses get suppressed and this could be often due to allopathic medicines and then goiter comes up think about a single remedy ferrum iodatum fatak repertory lights goiter after menses suppress single remedy ferrum iod and this ferrum iod women later on also develop prolapse of uterus or retroversion of uterus and these ferrum iod individuals they have state of ferrum who are very strong strong stamina anemia issues and iodum who are restless so they can be very quarrelsome and anxious they have a very typical dream and single dream dreams of fighting with robbers and they keep on fighting with the robbers and in the end they kill the robbers ferrum iod my god very interesting remedy i really want to share with you the the clinical material medic of, of 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 today's times and learn all these remedies in such a way that you'll be able to really go to the next level of ferrum iod